Halloween <laughs> and welcome to another episode of Andy Robinson RC. Cheers for checking out the channel today. <laughs> Today's episode is sponsored by Uppercut Monster Hold Hair Gel to keep you locking rotten. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to be able to do that voice all the way through the show. Right, uh, hello and welcome to a very special Halloween edition of Andy Robinson RC. And cheers for checking out the channel. Okay, so I hope you like our little spooky studio today. Right, okay, so for the Halloween episode, I wanted to do a Halloween build. And uh, I've always fancied doing uh, the CRP... Uh, monster truck conversion on the Tamiya Hornet chassis. So, I did start off with a Tamiya Super Storm Dragon, as that was the cheapest I could find a chassis. Uh, I think about £90. Where is that from? Jablin Models I picked that one up from. Now, uh, the reason I got that one was because I wanted the Super Storm Dragon for my Super Storm Dragon, because I made a mess of that body, so I got a new replacement body shell. Um, so I've redone that and that's gone on that uh, the wheels and tires have gone i've sold them to my good friend mark and uh, they're for his build he's doing and um so basically i've been left with the hornet chassis and so i've built that up ready so it's just a standard hornet chassis with the addition of bearings uh, throughout the kit right so the good bit is now you're getting on to transform it into a uh, monster truck so as a team crp uh did a conversion they've been doing one for years and they still make it and i picked up the parts on um, off ebay and they've come over from the us now if i look into my little uh, cauldron of goodies we'll see what we've got so i'll start with that so if you're interested in doing one yourself that's the team crp um conversion kit and it's part number one five six six i will put these um in the video description as well so you can go and find them out um, so essentially in this kit you get a front body post a rear body post and the body mounts that sit on the top and uh, the front body post locates in the usual place for a hornet there and the rear body post sits here on this top of the chassis and mounts and uh, it all fixes down and then you can obviously put your body on um, so that's Sort of the easy bit, so we need them to get all the screws and everything you need in that little kit. Okay, now also as well, because uh, it's going to be a monster truck, you do need to purchase these, if you can see them, which are the uh, Tamiya uh, Midnight Pumpkin or Lunchbox steering knuckles, because they've got the longer shaft on them to take the bigger wheels and tyres. So you're going to need them as well. So here you go, now I've got a few of them here. So we've got a set of Monster Beetle um, pin spike tires and wheels. So we're gonna be uh, putting them on this. And there's the other one. Now the other two are somewhere, but we don't read them right now. And then uh, for the body shell, which I'll show you in a minute, we have some paint, which is cool. So we're going for PS5, which is black. And we find it again, PS24, which is fluorescent orange. So sort of keeping in with the Halloween theme colours. So we've got them for it as well. Okay, um, so that's everything in my little cauldron. And so, yeah, we're going to build this into the uh, CRP Tamiya monster truck. Uh, it's very cool. If you Google it, you'll find images of people's past conversions. But I've never really seen many on uh, featured on YouTube videos, so I thought it'd be cool to build one and ideal for this Halloween uh, build. Now I've got a body for it. I didn't want to go down the same usual route as fitting as a like a Tamiya Blackthorn, 
or uh, you know a midnight pumpkin because I might as well just bought a pumpkin kit for that. Uh, I wanted to go with something different, so I've got an American pickup truck, um, and I'll show you what that is. And now this is a Proline um, body. And here it is. Hopefully you can see that. So it's a Proline body. It's a Chevy 1972 C10. So that's the truck body I'm going to fit. And the wheelbase is a pretty good match for this. So it just needs all cutting out. Now you do get window masks for this as well, which is good. You ought to really. Now I did buy another body. I've got things everywhere. But um, I, I basically got the sizing wrong. I didn't calculate it right. And it was a, a GMC K10 body. And it turned up and it was huge. And <laughs> basically it would have fit on my Clod Buster. Or a TRX4 as well as it was intended for. I, I don't know why I thought it'd fit this. But it, it just the wheel wheels just didn't line up correctly. So... Anyway, you get a few de decals in there, you get a choice of grills, some Proline stickers and lights. So they're the body uh, decals for that. Now, you get a set of window masks as well, which is good. That's always helpful. Now, I also got some of these for the body as well, because we're going to spray the front of the cab black uh, and then going into a fluorescent orange. And what I wanted to do is, if you can see these, I bought loads of bat decals. <laughs> and I'm going to do uh, loads of bats on it, basically. I just wanted to keep it quite fun and, and Halloween sort of looking, so that's what we're going to do. Um, so that's the plan for this build. So, uh, yeah, it should look uh, cool when it's done. Now, uh, I won't be keeping this, uh, this build. This build will uh, be moved on afterwards. Now, I haven't decided what, how I'm going to get rid of it yet. Am I just going to sell it? Or I might even try and do something uh, interactive with the channel. I've not decided yet. But first, we're going to get it built so you can see the finished product. Uh, so, yeah, that's my plan. Um, all good. So, um, I really hope you're all going to have an excellent, creepy Halloween. Uh, Halloween is also one of my uh, favourite times of the year. I even managed to dig out some of my old uh, <laughs> clothes from back in the day when I was being a, a goth. Um, also, as well, must me uh, mention a massive, massive thank you uh, to the Go Go Cult, uh, a band. Uh, like, a, if you get an idea what type of music they make, it's like a, a sort of a rock and roll garage sort of sound. Uh, so they call it the Go Go Cult, and um, a fair few years ago now, I uh, put them on a few times um, when I used to run my uh, psychobilly and goth music nights, and uh, yeah. So I, I reached out to them and asked them if they, they wouldn't mind me lending me their music towards my Halloween video. So of course, if you want to check them out, I will put the link in the description to this video. They're called the Go Go Cool. And the song that I was playing was called Bring Out Your Dead. Uh, they're very cool and I recommend you check them out. Okay, so I'll say links in the description. Right, I'm going to leave this one here for now. Thank you very much for joining me, and I hope you have a fantastic Halloween. Make sure you uh, subscribe if you haven't already, hit the like and notification bells, and uh, don't miss our follow-up video and our other content. Right, I'll see you soon. Have an excellent Halloween. Take care of yourselves. <laughs>